Hi guys and welcome to my channel. So today's video is going to be an all brand video, LA Girl Cosmetics. I got everything that you'll see in the video I got at Ulta for 10% off or 20% off and they have a coupon, spend $40, get $10 off. Girl, you better get that deal. Alright, so if you want to see how you can achieve this look, please keep on watching. All right, so all the products that I'm gonna use today are all LA Girl. I really wanted to emphasize me using literally like one brand. I've actually have never done that before. Um, so we're gonna see how it goes. Oh, and another thing, I've never used any of these products except for the concealer. So first things first, we're gonna do the eyebrows. So I'm gonna be using this LA Girl Shady Slim Brow Pencil in the color brunette. Let's see how this goes. Wish you luck. Okay, so I have my little compact mirror just because, uh, you know, it's kind of hard to see sometimes. Get him on his knees because he's my baby. Yeah, you're my baby. You're my baby. My baby. You're my baby. Johnny. I like to do like a more natural brow. So I literally just like to fill, I like to just fill in the natural shape of my eye, eyebrow, natural shape of my eye, that's a new one. Oh yeah, sorry if it sounds kind of loud, I have the AC on and I'm like, there's, one, there's no way I could do this video and like not have AC on, like I would be drenched. <laughs> Drenched in sweat, which is not something I want to show. Alright, eyebrows are done. Um, so far, I would say I really like this eyebrow pen. So, I don't know why I keep doing it. I keep shortening my words into two words when it's really one word. I really like this eyebrow pencil. Um, it gave me a nice natural look, which I love. I don't like to have, I don't really like to fill in my eyebrows too much. Um, so next we're going to go to the face. Um, we're going to be using this Pro Matte um, Foundation, which I've never used and I'm excited to use. So first step, we're going to do this smoothing face primer. I would do is like a dime amount. <laughs> dime amount. All right, we're going to smooth that on. Ooh. Yeah. Oh, and I already have moisturizer on, so I didn't put that in the video. So now, we're going to do the foundation. Um, I guess I'll do two pumps. I don't know. Oh. Ooh. So we're going to do two pumps, and I like to use my finger to like just slide it on. I hope I grabbed the right color. I grabbed um, caramel because I'm super tan you know it's the summer so gotta change that foundation color girls ladies um, I already damped my real techniques uh, sponge and we're going to win he can me by himself he gonna give me what I need I'm gonna make this thing work I'm gonna get him on his knees cuz he's my Okay, so so far I would say I like how it sits. It definitely does have a matte, um, a matte look. Like I don't look shiny. <laughs> like the Illuminati one definitely um, has a shine when you apply it. And I think I grabbed the right color as well. So yeah, I would say definitely two pumps is a good fair amount. Now we're going to do one of my my favorite parts. Conceal these dark circles. So I'm gonna uh, the, 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 the. I'm gonna be using the Pro Concealer in Cool Tan. Yeah, it's a new one. It's new. Yeah, and then to set it, we're gonna be using the Pro Powder. I got it in banana. 
just kidding. All right. So one thing I like to do is as soon as I apply my concealer, I like to automatically go in and put the um, setting powder because my under eyes have a tendency of creasing, which nobody likes that. So, away we go. So I like to do this. Great. Get that prepped. All right, so now we're gonna do the concealer. Hey guys, so in this section, I actually had to just speed up this clip because my camera died and then I called my husband to put me in focus and he didn't. <laughs> so um, the next few steps, I'm going to show you what I did, but unfortunately they're going to be kind of blurry because they're out of focus. And basically I finished blending my eyes and then I started doing the technique I told you guys about that as soon as I finished blending the concealer under one eye, I immediately put the setting powder, but I look up when I do it. So it kind of extends the skin and I'm not setting it with the creases, if that makes sense, like with the skin crease. So I'm just gonna speed up this section, but that's kind of the idea of what I did. So. Yeah, enjoy. I think I found a real one. When he get home, I give him something he could feel on. Feels right, baby boy, so it can be wrong. Feels right, baby boy, so it can be. He get me by himself. He gon' give me what I need. I purchased the um, volumatic mascara. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> In the matte eyeliner so so what I'm gonna do for my eyes is something a little different so I also bought the, I also bought the matte lipstick um, in the color in the color I don't even know Fleur Fleur F L E U R Fleur and I bought this velvet bronzed contour stick so we're gonna use these on the eyes we're gonna switch it up a bit Hey, this one looks used. Mm. I want my money back. <laughs> JK. Has that ever happened to you guys? Like, where you buy like a make a makeup product, and then like you realize it's been used. It's like, what do you do? Do you go back to the store and get a new one, or do you like say screw it? You know. All right. So for today's essentials, I actually bought these at the dollar store. They're wet and wild brushes and they're actually pretty good. I just restocked because I'm like, it's a dollar. Like, how can you not? So I bought a contour brush, a small eyeshadow brush, and a crease brush. I'm sorry, I can't talk today. I'm like, it's messy. It's messy. It's messy. Yeah, let's do this. Alrighty. We're doing it, guys. We're doing it. So far, so good. Alright, so we're just gonna. And then we're gonna okay. Baby, you're my baby, drive me crazy, you're my baby, you're my baby, you're my baby. Don't you know I got your baby boy, you know I'm dead. Alright, first thing I've noticed, it kind of picks up product from my eyes. So I'm kinda of worried about like when I actually put it on my face, hopefully it doesn't like pick up my um my foundation. That's how I know it's Tuesday. Then we hit the road that's for sure. And we're gonna blend it out with this small eyeshadow brush. Alright guys, so far so good. Now we're going to be using the eyeliner pen. So don't judge me. I like to put like a billion coats on. 
sorry guys, so my camera died. So I finished blending the right side, so I figured I'd blend the left side on camera. So I'm gonna start at the chin and work my way up. I was able to buy a blush, so we're gonna add that. Oh, what about this little guy right here? I just forgot. All right, we gotta blend the nose. All right, so now we're going to do the blush. So the blush color I got is just glowing. It's just glowing. I think it's because there's just a light shimmer. It is the highlighter. Oh yeah, I love this. This is good for like every day. Cause sometimes, you know, you're running or rushing out of the house, like you don't have time to do blush and um, highlight. So this is so pretty. No bottom mascara today. I'm gonna do my lips next and then setting, setting. And remember, um, the Just Matte, this is in Fleur. I think that's what it's called. Alright, so my camera has been dying and I just finished my makeup. I haven't put the spray yet. But I just looked in the mirror and I'm like, this ain't no barbecue makeup. This is like club makeup. So... If you're going out on the on the night, on the day, wherever, this would be a perfect look. But for me, a perfect look would probably be without the lipstick. So, final thoughts. I really, really love how my makeup came out. I think it looks very natural. I love that it's matte. So I'm actually gonna test it out for the evening. I'm gonna see like how long I actually can stay matte. Just because the foundation is matte, the, the setting spray is matte, you know, we have like the setting powder, so I'm hoping with all those combinations, like the of products, like my face will not grease out, if you know what I mean. So, um, will I buy these products again? Probably yes, in the future. Um, I will say the, um, the eyeliner pen, I thought it was very dry, the tip was very dry. But I think like if you start like shaking it a little bit, like you kind of get like some of the ink out. That was the only thing that I was kind of like a little hesitant about. Every other than that, I really liked everything else. I think my makeup came out pretty good. If you agree, um, yeah, I really liked everything. I think you guys should definitely try it. Let me know what you think. Let me know which which product was your favorite out of all the ones that I used. And um, actually let me know if you would like to see another video like this, like a, another one brand video, maybe L'Oreal or CoverGirl or Maybelline. You let me know and I will definitely do that for you. Yeah. All right. Um, what else? All right, yeah, so I guess I'm gonna go get dressed because my mom's picking me up. She told me I was supposed to be ready and I'm sitting here making a YouTube video. Go we'll figure. Alright guys, until next time. Stay tuned, I'm gonna make more videos, okay? Yeah. My baby, you're my baby, you're my baby.